since chapter 1079, or since it has been cooking really good. And I'm here to review chapter 1084, so let's get started. I was in shock when we started this chapter, where we left off in the previous chapter. I was in shock because I thought that, yeah, we might get back to Egghead Island, and that's what I was assuming in my predictions. I really thought that we'd be back in the Egghead Island, but guess what? We're still in this great flashback where we finally gonna see how Sabu saw Imusama and the whole story and we continue this story where we've seen Jury Bunny met Sabu and she told her that she's heading to Egghead Island but there's something that Sabu said that made me think that it might be a lie or like some hints from Orson Sensei to just make us distract from the whole thing which is when Sabu told Jury Bunny that oh you're heading to the Egghead and the new world we're heading in the opposite direction good luck in your voyage which is in my opinion I've seen many people were saying that Dragon might be heading to the Egghead Island or he might be there and he's gonna kill Saturn and that's how Orson Sensei is kinda like distracting us from the fact that Dragon is really gonna be there and that's how when Sabu said that, oh, we're going to the opposite direction, that was just a clever thing from Orson Sensei to just, to just make us think that, oh, yeah, so Dragon isn't going to the Egghead Island because it's in the opposite direction, which made me think even more that Dragon might actually be going to the Egghead Island and that would be insane. And now, oh my god, Cobra! was sitting on the wheelchair and in front of him was the five grossi and there we can see the empty throat and that panel was really dark I mean this chapter was really a unique chapter from Orson Sensei because we're used to the style of Orson Sensei where it's like more brightful, more cheerful but this chapter was so dark that made me think that that's not One Piece, okay? I mean I've seen a few panels of this chapter, they were really dark, and that wasn't a Ora Sensei thing, okay? But that was impressive, to be honest. And that's where we've seen this panel, where King Cobra was standing in front, or not, he was sitting in front of the five Gorosi, and they said, King Cobra, the ruler of Arabasta, what have you come to ask? And Cobra started from the beginning where he said about the world government was founded 800 years ago when 20 different countries gathered together to just make this uh, organization. And long story short, at that time, the queen of Arabasta was called Queen Lily. And in that time, she was supposed to be one of the 20 countries to just rule the world with as as it called the word government but guess what lily her name was immortalized as one of the founding 20 she did not stay to become a celestial dragon instead she was to return to arabasta to continue her reign which is why the nevertari family has continued to act as souvenir this also means that only 19 weapons were ever placed around the empty throne it's all as you say but what exactly is your point that's what the grossy said they seemed upset they really seemed upset because when King Cobra was talking about Lily, when he mentioned Queen Lily, the Grossi were super mad that they wanted to kill him. I mean, look at Saturn's face when Cobra mentioned Queen Lily. Oh my god, just look at his face! I mean, I was really scared how King Cobra continued his speech. Wow, okay, let's just continue from there, alright. King Cobra said, I have scoured all of my kingdom's ancient texts, but as far as I can tell, all known accounts chronicling the period after the void century have one thing in common. Her name isn't mentioned once. Oh my god, okay, I'll get to there, but let's just continue this chapter, okay? Alright, now, and he said, it appears Queen Lily never made it home to Arabasta, and the burden of ruling the country fell to her younger brother, which she had a brother. Alright, 
That's a really important information, okay? Do you have any record of what became of her? And guess what? We've seen Emu Sama was listening to this conversation on the Dende Mushi, and that seemed to me that Emu Sama taught the grossy to say the exact same thing every time somebody asks or mentions something related to this. Because that how it seemed to me when she was listening to the conversation. And how the way the grossy were talking in that time, it really seemed that she really taught them to speak this way, to just mention those facts. Wow, 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 let's continue, okay. And in conclusion, King Cobra said in that case, what is the meaning of D? Is Lily from the D family? So is it Lily D? Nevertari? Oh my god, so are the Nevertari actually from the D family? And that's also another question. Are they actually from the D family and why didn't King Cobra mention it before? I mean, King Cobra is a really smart guy, okay. So he doesn't really have to mention those type of stuff when he's working on something. So I guess that's why King Cobra knows about the importance of the D name or the D letter in the name so that's why he never mentioned it I guess I mean that's what I came up with I guess and here we are to the Shirahoshi thing at the same backstory where King Charles or th that idiot Charles was trying to take Shirahoshi and her brothers were trying to rescue her and at the end our grand fleet Leo and Sai attacked that idiot and look at his face. He was dying on the ground, but <laughs> he's not dead because we've seen Kizaru when he was talking about this incident. I guess they were talking about something related to his execution or something. I don't know, but he's not dead, unfortunately. And let's get this over with. Okay, we're back. We're back. We're back. We're back. We're back to the end of this chapter, which is... One of the most terrifying things I've ever seen, probably in my entire life. One of the most terrifying panels I've ever seen in my entire life. This chapter is really unique. I mean, you can say whatever you want to say about this chapter, okay? But this chapter was super unique to the One Piece style. The drawing, the panels, the dark, the way how Orsensei drew some panels. It was like... Perserk's type of uh, drawing or type of panels, it was like Kingdom's type of panels that was really dark and here we are, Imusama entered the castle or entered this room I don't want to say a small room because it doesn't seem small to be honest Imusama entered this castle, this place and she was hidden towards the empty throne and the Gorosi were screaming to Imusama, they were saying Imusama, King Cobra is still here, he's still here. And King Cobra was looking at Imusama with the shock in his face. He was in a true shock. He was in a disbelief. And, and Imusama said Lily and she sat down at the empty throne. And that was the end of the chapter and there is no chapter next week. There is a break next week. And I don't know how am I gonna wait for two weeks? That was a really insane chapter and I wasn't expecting this to happen. I mean, can you believe that the first appearance of Crocodile, he was touching a lily flower? I mean, these connections with Orson say, I just can't, I can never say these are coincidence, okay? It cannot be a coincidence because he was building from the very beginning of Arabasta till the very end of this chapter. Everything was built step by step, piece by piece. It's, it was like a Lego for Orson say, and he was like building it. Okay, that was really insane, not gonna lie. And the truth or the fact that the Nevertari family, which is the greatest family, the only family that has honor from these 20 families or the other 19 families in my opinion, the most lovable family from these 20 families, 20 countries, it was the source of this the king or the queen or the ruler of this world that was one of the most shocking things i've ever seen in one piece probably that was the, the greatest twist in one piece probably if Imusama is 
Lily, okay? It's, it, it is still not confirmed that Aim Sama is Lily, so we just gotta wait and see. But the fact that Cobra, King Cobra mentioned Lily, and he mentioned that her name wasn't there, wasn't in any of the texts or any of the books that were there in Nevertari family or in Arabasta, that shows you that the Lily name gotta be something really huge. It, it's either it's Imu Sama herself or something crazy happened in that time where probably Imusama killed so that's why she she might she might have killed Lily and you can never tell anybody that he actually killed the king or the ruler of a certain country or a certain, or a certain kingdom while it's one of the 20 countries that rules the world as the world government okay so that was chapter 1084 right now in comments in the below what do you think and what would you rate this chapter i would definitely give it five stars even though the whole show thing wasn't actually great but it was but it made sense because or since they had to end this chapter with this huge panel, okay? With this terrifying panel. So I'm almost definitely gonna give it a 5 stars. So I guess that's it, guys. Don't forget to comment down below. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share this video with everybody on this planet. Thank you, guys. Until next time. See ya.